Super Mario Brothers is roughly 30 years old and a new glitch has just been discovered. As a big Nintendo fan, I had to try it on a real NES. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial to reach this new glitch. Step 1. You need to beat the game, so the Goombas from level 1-2 will become Buzzy Beetles. Step 2. Start a two-player game and get killed on the first screen of World 1-2 with Mario. You should get the first one up to get an extra chance if you miss the glitch. Step 3. With Luigi, get to the second Hammer Brother of World 5-2 and hit the block to grow the vine. Doesn't matter if you switch the role of Mario for Luigi, by the way. Step 4. You now need to die while climbing the vine. Common mistakes. You need at least a little upward motion to get the glitch working. If you get to Mario without the vine, just kill yourself and try again until you're game over. If you climb the vine without getting hit, don't move, stay in the bonus zone and wait for timeout. This will be shorter than starting over. Come on! Come on! Kill me! Come on! Finally! Step 5. A glitch vine will now grow in World 1-2 and Mario will be able to get infinite lives by hitting the Buzzy Beetles. I'm not as skilled as the guy in the original video. I kept dying when trying to hit them on the left side. I prefer to play it safe to show you guys the glitch. If you need more practice, I suggest using a Game Genie with code YYTOZA to start with 155 lives. I know it seems awkward to start with that many lives to try a glitch giving you even more lives. You can reach this glitch anywhere in the game. If you're curious, try to bring Mario in another world and do the trick with Luigi to see what happens. Feel free to write in the comment section below if you find anything interesting. I'm Giz. Thanks for watching.